and thanks so much for dropping by the channel. Just a few facts in this video about the amazing underwater world of nudibranchs. Number 1. When looking at the spelling of the word nudibranch it would be easy to say nudibranch, but the correct pronunciation is nudibranch. Number 2. On the nudibranch's head is a pair of tentacles known as rhinophores. These are equipped with scent receptors that allow the nudibranch to smell its food or locate other nudibranchs. Number 3. There are over 3,000 species of nudibranchs, from the shallows to depths of 2,500 meters. They are found in tropical waters as well as very cold climates. They are almost entirely restricted to salt water. Number 4. Nudibranchs get their bright colors from the food they eat. Some are poisonous while others pretend they are. They feed on stinging cells of hydrozoids and store them in their bodies as a defense mechanism. They can also ingest toxins from sponges and become toxic and inedible. Number 5. The little flower-type protrusions on the back of the nudibranch are their exposed gills which they breathe from. The word nudibranch comes from the Latin word nudus, and the Greek word branchia, meaning naked, and gills. Number 6. Some nudibranchs such as Philodesmium longicerum are solar-powered or photosynthetic, living off the sugars that are produced by the sunlight absorbing algae in their bodies. Number 7. Nudibranchs typically deposit their eggs within a gelatinous spiral, which quite often looks like a ribbon. Some species might just lay a few eggs or others as many as an estimated 25 million. Number 8. The Spanish Dancer is the largest known nudibranch and one of the largest sea slugs on the planet, reaching sizes of at least 16 inches. Smaller species can be very difficult to see, even with the naked eye. Number 9. Nudibranchs are hermaphrodites. Male and females of the species possess reproductive organs of both sexes. While mating they fertilize each other, however a nudibranch cannot fertilize itself. Number 10. Nudibranchs are not known for their swimming abilities but some species actually have a foot, which they can use for swimming. They are mostly restricted to the ocean floor using their foot muscle to move along. They do have eyes but can only distinguish between dark and light. Thanks very much for watching, and if you could hit the subscribe button that would be great. Until the next time, cheers for now.